first thing. I already uploaded everything I need to do for today. Did you just message me? No. That's not it. What is it? Chicken hot hot. <laughs> Tell me what you just said to the camera. I want chicken pot pie. Why do you want chicken pot pie? It's Thursday. That's the whole reason it's Thursday? <laughs> it's not. It's just, I've been craving chicken pot pie for so long, and your diner has one of the best chicken pot pies in New Jersey. Right? That They did have a plaque there, right? And they said that? I or something don't like remember. that? It was like a little news or whatever that they had. I know you had told me that before, and then I tried it that one time. That one time that we were able to get it. And. That was years was, ago. Yeah, I know. It's crazy. Dude, I don't know. I've been going to like Wegmans and I see like the chicken pot pies. I'm like, is it good though? Do I really want to buy it and try it? So I just want to see if it's as good as I remember or better. And if we are even able to get the chicken pot pie, because, you know, last couple of times we tried, it was sold out. Fuck. Oh, yeah. Well, that's why we're going now in the middle yeah, of the afternoon. Middle of the, yeah. Middle yeah, middle, middle of the day before, all, I mean, after the retirees got out and before the high school kids get out of school, right? I don't know. Should we share one or should we, like... If Let's well, the the thing is, we is. we order one. Okay. If it's good, oh, <laughs> we okay, would okay, get okay. another one what and take it home. Good? I thought, okay, well, yeah, I mean, obviously, okay, if it's okay, like, okay, 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 okay. People are just saying it's fucking. Wait, there's horse. I, I don't remember driving this way. This is the scenic route. Oh, yeah, you kind of go oh, in a circle. Like, this reminds me of okay. So back then when we would, I wouldn't even say it's like location scouting, but it kind of is location scouting. Mm -hmm. I, we would drive around, get lost in Jersey, and just look at places. <laughs> You're not taking me to some like weird haunted road or some shit. No, I don't think this is haunted road. Okay. I think it looks like I like mean, mountain this roads. I mean, look really scary at night for sure. There's no lights. Yeah. Yeah, actually, that's why it's kind of cool. I don't know if like. Feel street racery. Oh my god! No, what? Yeah, dude, fuck it. Let's go. Stop. Let's go. <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh, it's the it's like the mountains. We're driving oh, through the mountains right it. now. We could be in the mountains right now. It looks like the mountains when you're driving through the mountains. If you're yeah. on a mountain with a bunch of trees. Like, can you tell you're on a mountain? <laughs> no, but they don't need to know that. <laughs> like, see, like, this looks fucking cool to me. If you're, you would love driving here. Just like heel. I mean, it just says slow 30. Yeah, fuck it. You can, like, this car is still spec. You feel it hug the road. You, right? Yeah. When I'm making those turns? Oh, I yeah. Do... Yeah. <laughs> so, if we had, like, a friend of ours from out of state, like, let's just say Cuddle comes to visit, and we're just like, hey, hey, man, um, yeah, you want to go on, like, a little scenic adventure? Mm hmm You would take him on this? What? No, it's just, it'd be nice to, if we had bikes, if we had bikes, if you knew how to ride a bike, we could ride this, and it would be really nice. We've longboarded this area, it's very, well, the... When it, the road is nice, like the path that we were had, but once oh, we're here, this doesn't seem very safe. All right, what do you? Cars, and then you want to ride a bike? Yeah, they'll and move around you. Yeah. You yeah. got hit by a car. That was like a long time ago. He got hit by a car in Jersey. I protected the iPad. On a very like, like the road is wide. It was okay. I'm not trying to be sexist here, but it was a woman driver, and she did not care. Yeah. And it could, she could have been racist. I don't know. But like, it could have been an act of violence. Yeah, definitely. But I'm just saying, this is narrower. What? I, just, there's not a lot of cars here. You point to one car. <laughs> there's two cars up there. We're a car and there's a car behind us. Well, people still use this road. It's not like... <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, 
know. But Aren't there, like... When we play D&D, we should have a fellowship. <laughs> yeah. Whenever you got... Uh, we have to set it up, but yeah. And? Yes? Okay. We just need to... Just need one shot on Ange. Just, like... <laughs> just <laughs> just nodded. It. Yo. I want to go indoor skydiving. Would you do that? Yeah, why not? It's safe. Yeah, it's indoor. It's indoors. <laughs> But You're isolated. The worst that will happen is like, what, you'll fall like 10 feet. That sounds like it still hurts if you really I think mean, about I it. I think comparison to like in the clouds, I'm just saying. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you're not plumbing the earth, yes. I, I, I definitely agree it would be a much safer alternative, you know. Wait, <laughs> falling so, 10 feet then. So is it like a whole simulation type of thing? Like as you're falling, like they have it projected so it looks like you're getting close to the fucking ground? I think it's like a it's like a vertical wind tunnel and they just blow air at you. And you're, <laughs> I think you see the ground. <laughs> I think you still see the ground. And you're like, that 10 feet's gonna hurt if I fall fucking flat. Like like your belly flopping on that shit. I don't know. No, that's not a problem. Okay, here we go. Hey. Anyway. Ooh, what the fuck? <laughs> So it's we, here. there's fucking bugs everywhere. So we were here at Voorhees Diner. This is a place where we used to frequent mm. all the time. Yeah. Since this is like literally 30, uh, 30 seconds away from. And it's open all the time. Well, except it, that one time. Except for, you know, <laughs> during the two years where nothing was open. Yeah. All right. But yeah. Chicken pop. <laughs> Chicken pop. Yeah, sorry, I've been waking. You've been waiting. Just tell me. Uh, I just cut it in threes and. Nah, you just grab whatever. Get it from the center. Oh wait a minute! It's because it's in a in the like the the tin. Yeah, you can't see it. No, I can't see it because on my side it's just. Oh. Crust. Wait. You know what? I'm just gonna. I've said this multiple times before throughout our friendship. There used to be a place called Soupies. And then you had chicken pot pie soup, and it was the most delicious thing. What? I, yeah, I, I wish soupies were still around. But that's like... Also, okay. What if I made this for crafties? Like, in little sections. You guys, it's literally crap singles melted on okay. cheese <laughs> and gravy. I think I can make... No, Wait. I know I can make better gravy than this. For seven dollars and twenty-five <laughs> fucking cents, dude. We're, we're here for the freaking chicken pot pie, Joey. That I can't make. Or I could learn, I'm supposed to. Ooh. Oh my god. Yeah, this shit's good. It's still good? Yeah. I don't mind a little bit. Hot. Thank you. You are too. <laughs> <laughs> but why specifically though, chicken pot pie? Why? What? Because I remember. I know it sounds silly, you know. And people might think this is like kind of scripted. This literally was like what she said yesterday or two days ago, mm -hmm. and we're like, let's go on Thursday. What? Why chicken pot pie? It's something I've been craving for for like. I want to say the past year. Oh my god, that's actually good. Right? And it's like, because you can buy chicken pot pie from like, I guess the grocery store where it's like frozen or you can get the ones at Wegmans where they're just kind of like, you have to like bake it. But I don't know how those turn out. But I know that this one is good. So it's like, I want to go to this diner and eat it. And yeah, I don't know. I was just I guess I could... craving it. This really is. Like, I've just been craving it for a very, very, very long time. I mean, learn how to, just and, learn how to make it, yes. right? Like, Smart. the chicken, it's like, they use, like, the dark meat, and it, like, falls apart. It's nice. Mm. These big-ass slices of <laughs> potato. Mm -hmm. 
What's your favorite? What's your favorite diner food ever? Chicken parm. Chicken parm. Oh shit! Yeah. Mm -hmm. But oh, we should go back every, to that diner. Because <laughs> every diner is different, right? Mm -hmm. So like, they all do like the recipes all differently. But the one place, actually, there's two places that have like really good chicken parm, and I made it a thing like. Every time I go to a new diner, I have to order the chicken parm. I want to see who has the best chicken parm. The one is oh, like shit. Mayfair I... Diner, and then the other one that we went with Tom. I think I. Yeah. Yeah. That is one thing I remember. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is that like an, maybe it's like an East Coast thing, or what we do? Diners. Because I diners know, all over the states. Right? I know, but like I feel like diner culture is a. I'm sure there's like a diner culture when it comes to like foodies or something. Yeah. Because I know my... Diners, drive-ins, and dives. Oh, what is I that? I don't know why I wanted to add oh my at the end of it. It's by a guy, here, the, the spiky hair dude. Oh, right, that right, show. right, right. Okay. Because I know mine was like every time I go to a new diner, mm -hmm. back then, I would order... I would order, what was my, it, it, bacon, sunny side up oh, eggs, yeah. you and had toast. A, a breakfast um, thing. That's, yeah. how, that's how I grade diners, mm. by your toast and bacon. And that's eggs. It, and <laughs> eggs. Let's see, because eggs definitely are the easiest food to make, but like the hardest to master. Mm -hmm. Actually, no, it's not really hard to make if you really think about it. Because anyone could just drop eggs in like hot water and think it's food or some stupid shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> because you watched that video. Oh. Of, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, Jersey styled um, <laughs> fries is. What, is that craft singles on with like what kind of gravy and it, it's like it's like turkey gravy mm. <laughs> turkey gravy in jersey that makes yeah, dude they definitely use like dark meat chicken this can't be hard to make i guess that's my next project there how to if you want make chicken pot pie Oh my god, you know, yo, if this thing that we're doing is an excuse to go places. <laughs> you know what I totally, totally miss? I've been mm -hmm. saying it for fucking months. What? Can I go get Indian food? Yeah. Butter chicken? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, dude. That's mm -hmm. it. Because the thing is, like, I know I can make it. It's just mm -hmm. that the ingredients to make that is not something that I cook with all the time yeah so i want to get things that like i can't get normally or i'm too lazy yeah. to make yeah and it's not like i can't it's just more like the the ingredients kind of go to waste when like i don't use yogurt on a daily basis mm -hmm. i don't use you know like yeah and then it ends up being a waste yeah no. i just wish someone could come to this diner and try this chicken pot pie and be like hey this tastes exactly like that store but like brand whatever what and be fuck? like dang Okay. Oh no, I just wanted like some pie crust. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Somebody blows this place up. Right? This is definitely, I, we can go to Walmart right now and make this motherfucker. Make this motherfucker when we go home. $7.25. I wonder what it takes to like make a diner here in Jersey. Hold on. I don't know. Okay, here's a funny story. Okay. Okay. Thanks for joining us, guys. Yeah. <laughs> so. How's everything? Good? Yeah. Oh, delicious. Thank you so much. Actually, okay. 25. Is there <laughs> diners in, like, other countries? Or is it just an American thing? That's definitely an American thing. Is it? Okay. Because, I, I mean, in hmm. Japan, I remember, like, going to a hard rock cafe there. Oh, shit. Dude. Was it Denny's or IHOP? Mm -hmm. I went to a Denny's in Japan, mm -hmm. and I love Denny's because, like, you know, 
in the university, that's the where I would study, right? It's like fine dining, <laughs> Yeah. Oh, and parts of Western Europe. Yeah, I guess. What? But also, like, the, the Denny's in Japan, I was like, what the hell? This is, like, actual fine dining. Actually, yeah, I'm curious, because I know, like, we have some, like, I know our, our patrons, some of them are from Europe. So I'm curious with, like, the rest of the audience. Yo, do you guys have a diner that you guys go to? And what is your go-to uh, food of choice at these diners? <laughs> It's mine's chicken parm. I don't know. There's just something about it. Like it has, like the chicken parm. It can't be like too wet. Like and it makes the crust. What if chicken parm of the chicken parm, like you know, like soft? Is that is that an American American Italian thing or is that an Italian thing? Uh, I don't know. Cause like I know, like I said, mine was like two sunny side up eggs, two strips like strips of bacon, mm -hmm. toast. Northeast United States, or yeah, dude. Oh, so that's a that's a so that's another fun fact. It's that's a Northeast. Some random information for this this episode. Wow. <laughs> so chicken parm is like a Northeast American from Italian immigrants. Italian, yeah, thing. That's that's awesome. Man, so I can't go like let's just say we like take a road trip. Like across the states, I can't just go to every diner and be like, "Yeah, I want to." No, they have chicken parm. It's just it, I think it came from. Oh, okay. That's what it said. Because <laughs> definitely. <gasps> and I'm setting up to leave. All right. So. Okay. How did how did you like the chicken pot pie? It was really good. I was definitely disappointed with fucking New Jersey <laughs> style home fries with cheese and gravy. Yeah. Like literally, I. I mean, it was just, just pieces of cheese that they just. Wait, like, cause this on. is, cause this was. Well, okay, let me tell this story first before I ask that question. Okay. Cause the thing is, what I wanted to ask earlier was, I wonder what it takes to open up a diner in New Jersey, and then it reminded me of the story why, or how I made Agent Auntie the character. Yeah was because it started because a friend of ours, I don't know if I already said, I'm sure there's just record this already. Friend of ours back then, she used to work at a uh, mall like food court. Mm -hmm. And apparently she was telling me that there was like, some happened at the, at the Cherry Hill food, like at the food court where like in the, in the back alleys in the service hallways, there was like a rumble with like two Chinese restaurants and it was the old <laughs> ladies they were fucking fighting each other, right? And I, I thought about, and like Asian auntie came from the idea that I wanted to write a story about all, everything was about a, a, just in a food court where it's like, it's a gang war. It's a gang war between food, food like oh restaurants. And that's where Asian auntie kind of came up. Which one would you rather prefer for dessert? Okay. Rita's or Auntie Anne's? Rita's. Okay. Yeah. Why yeah. Rita's? Over Auntie Anne's. Okay, Rita's is one of those like desserts that you would just drive to because you're craving it. It's a hot summer day or whatever. Auntie Anne's is like if you're shopping and it's like, oh look, there's Auntie Anne's. I'm just gonna go get some Auntie Anne's. That's the reason why you would ever buy Auntie Anne's. I see. Like my ritual at the mall is like Auntie Anne's. Is it's the mall the mall thing still a thing yes it exists <laughs> like but, sorry i wanted to just it's a, cut it's the, a real thing i want to just go through here because like the cop behind us i don't want him to like oh. pull us over because i have like cameras and shit going Dash, it's dashboard cam like. and then he sees that then he sees this uh, that's, that's also it. dashboard cam also a dashboard cam <laughs> all right so we're going to read us yes who goes to Annie Ann's just for Annie Ann's? I thought Annie Ann's was like good by itself. I, like, I guess I'm asking the merit of the place. Because <laughs> I've never seen Auntie Ann's have like a, a store by itself. Like just like a, you know, a, a normal a brick and mortar. Yeah. Brick and, wow, that's... Morta. Morta. Ew, that was like New Jersey as fuck. <laughs> that was New Jersey as fuck. No, uh, like a brick and mortar store. Yes. Like I haven't seen 
it's, you know, a satellite store outside of a mall my I'm entire life. I'm sure there are. I'm sure there is. I'd like to believe that there is. Yes. But I've never seen one. Have you seen one? I have. But, again, I would never just go to an Annie Ann's. Like, I don't know. Annie Ann's finally gives us drive through pretzels. I'd like to see one. I don't think I've had enough Auntie Anne's because I never really went to the mall. That's... You can't say you never went to the mall. Okay, I've been, of course I've been to the mall. Let's go to the, the mall, mall today. today. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Robin Sparkles. Hell yeah. <laughs> Anyways. Um... Actually, Rita's should have a drive-thru. Rita's does have a drive-thru. We've been to the drive-thru a bunch of times. We have? <laughs> yes. We would, you would order from the drive-thru. What are I you talking about? We would get pints through the drive-thru. How come all the times that I remember it, like, we would go up no. to it and we would get the Be- box Because it's much it. more memorable when we're, like, talking and conversing and shit. Oh, then what are we gonna do today? Are we doing the drive-through? Do you want we... drive-through? Yeah, let's let's drive through. Oh drive-thru. man, I gotta take this shit off. Maybe we should walk to it. Oh wait, yeah, I, <laughs> I gotta take this camera off. <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> I was gonna say can't. Ant- oh wait, no, this is. No, you then you have to get out. Fuck. <laughs> 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 Any ends in an old town. Whole... This is what the storefront looks like. Oh yeah. Well, they don't all look like that, though. They're the ones, like, if you see, um, those, like, plazas. Like strip malls? Have I seen a truck? I think I've seen a truck. A food truck? Yeah. Yo, we should find a food truck, like, best. We should go to Philly for food trucks. I thought the whole idea was to keep it in Jersey for the oh, first okay, season okay. or something. Yeah, but the food trucks in Jersey, like... It's the same. It's not like they can't drive to Philly. I'm sure those things go to <laughs> Philly, too. It's but the same I, fucking food trucks. It, no, it's different. It's different. It's because we're in Philly. Oh, my God. Are you talking about, like, just, like, the the Philly staples? Like... Yeah. Okay, I like guess University I mean. City, they have like food trucks along, uh, I think it's like 38th, that's just there like all the time. They, they're stationed there like all the fucking time. Jersey, the only time I've ever had a Jersey food truck, besides that one time at that like little plaza thing. That's like close. You guys, yeah. yeah. Um, was, what's the term? Like there's like this term for like, I guess like the, the subs or the hoagies that's like hangover cures oh the uh, the uh the like fat, fat something holy something. shit um oh my god they changed the name they changed the n- grease trucks oh grease well, okay, trucks no. yeah it's grease trucks but i thought there's like holy a term fuck for, like the actual food at the grease trucks the name of it yeah oh no dude i've only had fat bitches fat bastards oh fat fucks all of, basically, all of the names to win with a curse word at the end. But those are so heavy and greasy and just, it's yeah. too much. Grease trucks. It's I, it, too much. It was definitely that meant for I like... That is what I think when I think Jersey food trucks. It That was... Grease trucks were for college kids during 2000s. Maybe, maybe 90s. But, Definitely 90s. But the food trucks I'm talking about in Philly, they're also for college kids because it's like... Not when you have... UPenn, Drexel, and University of the Sciences. But not when you have, like, menus dedicated, like, that people can... Your your clients can make. Like, oh, if you eat this shit within 30 minutes, you get to make a sandwich and we'll call it whatever the fuck you want. But there's a really good one that I really like. I didn't make it. I'm sure somebody else made it. It's called Fat... <laughs> And it was delicious. <laughs> <laughs> that it's it's on the menu. It was on the menu. Fat <laughs> I'm like, I would like to have a fat <laughs> please. You know how funny? <laughs> I just say Wait, that. How is this 
Okay, with the whole cancel culture going on. Yeah, out. that's what I'm saying. I don't think it will work now. But this is during, like, I'm talking about, like, 2004 right now. Are we right going to get canceled just because you're talking about it? About a food place that, that was real? Yeah, I don't know. I don't people, think so. People are sensitive. Actually, our audience isn't sensitive. Because you I know it, cool. I know they changed it. Because, like, the thing is, I know it was called Grease Trucks, but I think they definitely changed the name to Fat Something. Because all, like, because their yeah, menu was, was called... Yeah, Fat Something. I think I know the previous version called Grease Trucks. Then when people start naming stuff, like, you know, Fat Bastard definitely was because of that, um, you know, uh, the movie, uh, the Austin Powers movie and stuff like that, right? Uh-huh. Fat Bitch or whatever, like, very simple names. But then people, I guess, start making that. I, I know it, it changed to, like, Fat something. Then Are they still around? The last time I saw it, I was with, with Flip. So he was here. And it was not the last time he was here. It was like the, no, the time yeah, before that. No, yeah, before. For like a Smash Brothers tournament, I was with Tin, and we were eating food. I bet Tin inhaled his. Dude, it was so terrible. Fucking playing <laughs> tournament Smash Brothers, like, gl- oh my god, that, that's like a terrible time in my life. Playing fucking, trying to do fighting games professionally, like, <laughs> so stupid. But Grease Trucks, cause. I remember getting it at Rowan. No, no, Rowan. Sorry, sorry. Uh, 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 Rutgers? Oh my. Rutgers. That's where I first saw I think saw that's it. where I got it, too. But I know... But it was, like, in other universities. It wasn't just at Rutgers. Uh, but I know definitely it was, like, a... It's, like, a New Jersey thing. Is she by herself? No. Looks like she has friends. Now we can creep in. <laughs> yeah, could I interest you guys? <laughs> Some, uh, I, I heard the mango. <laughs> mango here is delicious. Okay, so normally when we go to Rita's, we always get the same shit, which is... Mango. Mango. This time we're trying something different. What'd you get? Coffee milkshake. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Coffee milkshake. How is it? It's actually... So there's a guy before us that ordered this mm-hmm. for him and his wife, it looks like. Right? And it, it's like... I was like, oh, that sounds good, you know? Mm-hmm. I, you know, might as well try something new, right? Because every for the years that we've come here, mango ice, mango water ice all the time, oh. right? Because it's really good. But this, this is actually really good. I'm sorry, I mean, this is not what I expected. Mm-hmm. It's very light. It's a very subtle in flavor of the coffee, mm-hmm. but it's definitely not overpowering. It's actually really delicious. Would you like to try it? It's going to taste weird with the mint. There you go, Angie, you want to try it? So I got the mint custard with chocolate chips. It took us so long to fucking Hold on. Yeah, right? It's not bad, right? That tastes delightful. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's not bad. Definitely not bad. That's really good. Yeah. But I like mint chocolate chip ice cream, but this is like, I don't know. Or maybe like, you're just finally realizing that mint is disgusting. It's like, it like wants to be a shamrock shake. Yo, wait, shamrock shakes are good though. Mm-hmm. That's why it's really weird to me. Oh shit, and that's only during, around St. Patty's, right? Mm-hmm. But I don't want too much. Mm-hmm. It's toothpaste. Mint's, mint's toothpaste, man. Yeah. Well, that guys suck. Diner fact? Sure. Okay, the fact is that hardly any diners were built from old railroad cars. They were just made to look that way, actually. What? Oh, right, right. Remember on Mayfield, mm, here's the, like, a little association. When we were there, they had that fact on their menu when you took me there. What? That diners were created, or the original diners were, like, the last, uh, the last carts or, uh, you know, train carts on a train. Mm-hmm. You're right. Lunch, it's a lunch wagon of some sort. Yeah. yeah. That's the origin. Like, drawn lunch wagon. Dang. Yeah. Your Good turn. Crap. Shit. <laughs> I like still chewing. Yeah. So, because supposedly. No, you don't. We don't. We don't need to. Okay. It's fine. Gotcha. That's interesting. Mm hmm. I don't know, for some reason, my mind just went to, like, um, Kage and Tony trying to get on that 
fucking train while we were like up north in like upstate New York. We we're trying to like haul their asses out, and then Joey went missing. And then you got mad at us because it's like, where did you guys go? What the fuck? We were outside looking. I for went you. to the only other place possible in that area was back inside the bar. Did anyone check inside the bar? Yes. No, you guys did it. Yes. I literally took a piss and walked back out. I think what had happened was like, okay, so <laughs> this is like what it looks like. It's a square, like, I guess, area. Mm-hmm. And we're outside in the back. So Kage and Tony, they like, they're trying to get on the train. Me and Andrew were around here somewhere trying to get them back. Joey's walking this way, so I guess when you went to the bathroom and as we were looking for you, I guess when you stepped out, did you go the other way around or this? No, way? I went. I went to the front to make sure if you guys were in the front, then you guys were there. So I went around back. Look. Yeah. The shit. I, I don't know. Then I'm looking for you guys. I'm like, why the fuck did they disappear? Then I see you guys. I'm like, why did you fucking? Leave? What the fuck? Like, why did you guys leave? Well, we didn't leave. We we're looking for you. Everyone was looking for you. We all split up to look for you. We couldn't find split you. Split up? Yes. No one, so no one ever thought about going counterclockwise? Yes, we did. Then how come you guys didn't see me? That's what we're wondering. That was a fun day, though. I mean, what I remembered. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was fun for you guys. It was work for Ange and I. Because it's like... Okay, we're going to work. We're going to do this. And, like, we didn't actually release, like, because the next place, it kind of was, like, a wash. Um, it was closed. No, remember it was, like, that winery place where they had the wine samples? Okay, so- oh, yeah, yeah. Yes. Oh, no, that was a very, 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 very boring very fucking. Boring. But. I want to make a very boring video since you guys asked for it. <laughs> well, I mean, you guys ask like, "Oh, what's your day like or your week like?" Are you fucking boring. joking? It's boring as shit. It's very boring. <laughs> Anyways, but like, we go to the next location. We didn't release the video because it's really, really boring. But I had told the guy that was giving samples, I was like, "Hey, my three friends, they're a bit drunk, so just ease up on the samples." But they would like to try it, and we're like recording a video. Let the mm-hmm. guy know. He poured double fucking, like, amounts for everybody. And you guys tried all of the available wine that was I, there. It's not like I wanted to. It was more like whatever Kage and Tony are drinking, Yeah, I'm drinking. But this guy was also like, oh, no, no, no. Here, try this one. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, I told the guy, like, well, what are you doing? I was like, yo, this three is fine. You guys tried, like, eight. <laughs> I don't remember any of that. <laughs> was his name Richard? I don't remember, but I was like, oh, come Tricky on, dick. man. Come <laughs> on. But wait, I do know what I wanted. Oh, because oh, there were ducks. Okay, I do remember. There were yes, ducks and I was... fed them. <laughs> I fed the ducks. Mm-hmm. That was a very boring fucking... It... Or I just didn't know how to edit it. I'm looking at the, the fuck is happening. I'm literally, I'm I'm talking out of my fucking mind in this <laughs> vlog. Like it's it was it like it's not like oh funny haha Uncle Joey's drunk or something like that. It's like what the fuck is wrong? <laughs> it looked like we were like functioning adults. Then then we started talking. Then it's definitely not. It looked like there was something wrong with everything that was happening. Like, the only one that was kind of okay was Kage. But even then, it wasn't even that, like, great. I think when he gets drunk, he gets, like, more, like, pleasant. He like, gets, I mean, like, he's, he's... He gets, like, mellow, and then he, like, tries to, like, talk a lot more. Yeah. Like, deeper into things. Because the one pre... But cause... then it's, like, you and Tony are just, like, fucking around, and Tony's <laughs> just standing there, like... I was... It doesn't... Yeah. He's just smiling a but, little bit. But, you know, it was funny, because, like, that... What was the McDonald's? <laughs> we have to get food. <laughs> oh, shit. Food. We have to get food in the middle. We got to move that shit. Because I, cause I suggested, <laughs> oh, shit. That was like an hour. We didn't record any of that shit. <laughs> no. We did. Record did we? Because yeah, I said I was, because my idea is like, guys, I'm getting, I'm getting real fucking drunk. I can feel it. 
we need like carbs in our like my reasoning is i need carbs in my system or like fast food because marathon runners would eat <laughs> fast food to to process that shit so they could just have the quick sugar intake to to keep running how i thought that would work with with alcohol, I don't know. It has. I'm sure that's not based on logic or fucking whatever. I have to say, when Joey is inebriated, though, he does like he is the voice of like reason at random. I try. Points. I definitely it's try. It's like, oh shit, yeah, actually, that's right. He's smart. Like <laughs> we should do that. But it it, it held off. It held off. It's, it's just that now we were active and drunk, and that maybe was terrible for you guys. Because as somebody said on on on. Um, Comment in on that video is like hurting cats, I guess. <laughs> and like, <laughs> <laughs> yes. Holy shit. Holy fuck. I'm like holding on to dear life when it comes to like, because alcohol hits hard, man. Am I not see like, do I? Tony's like, yeah, I'm ready. And he's the one that gets fucked up the fastest. I'm yeah. Like, <laughs> and I'm like, wait, hold on, man. We got, whoa, 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 man. Why are we getting slow? <laughs> Why are you doing this? Okay. Stop that. Do you like, do you... I remember, I do have footage of the three of us eating peacefully in the back. Yes. <laughs> Just, you were driving, I guess, because we, the car was moving. We were like trying to eat like our... <laughs> <laughs> For a moment, it was quiet. Thanks guys for watching this episode. <laughs> if you guys would like to see Tony and Kage come back yeah. and me and Ant heard everyone like cats again, let us know. We'll try to make that happen. The herding of the cats? Yeah. I mean, I'm down to drink. I'm just saying, like, I don't drink often. I know, which is why it's such a bad idea. Yeah. But this time... At least I don't hurl or some shit, this like... This time, you guys should just stick to flights. I don't know why Tony and Kage were just buying, like, cups on their own. And, like, I was like, I taste the, the alcohol. Like, it's fucking tea, man. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm pretty damn sure this is just tea. I know I was... I was getting drunk out of my mind there, but I like I know when tea tastes like tea. I drink tea a lot. I'm like, oh. it was cut out, but he like was real deep for like ten minutes <laughs> about like how how it's alcohol and the depth right of literally the bar owner. <laughs> oh yeah, no, that's just, <laughs> yeah, it's just tea, and I'm like, and he's like, it's tea, and then you look at the menu, and it's like, oh shit, it's tea, it's tea. <laughs> the beat Tony are laughing at him for a little bit, but. I, I just know tea. I just know tea. I don't know. All right. Mm -hmm. Please uh, <laughs> comment, like, subscribe. Sorry, this is this is our way of of um, powering down because mm -hmm. you guys already know we're in the middle of a very very big production that I've been working on, uh, and we can't wait to tell you guys. But until it's ready, you know, we can't really say anything. This actually forces us to kind of like take a break. This. Yeah. So I'm making it into a series. This is a series. Welcome to TFTI. Thanks for the invite. <laughs> or travel food, travel information. <laughs> sure. Or travel food, travel. Other acronyms you guys can think of. TFTI. Let us know. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Bye. Bye.